Hi, my name is Vladimir and in this tutorial I will show you how to make Minecraft portable and use it without having Java installed. The end result is a portable Minecraft that can be run from USB and used on computers that don't have Java installed. To begin, create a new folder on your USB drive and name it Minecraft. Then we need to download Minecraft from its official website. Go to minecraft.net, click on download here and download the minecraft.exe file. This will download the Minecraft installer from its original website. Now we need to put the file that we've just downloaded to the new folder that we've created previously. First, we need to download the Java Portable Launcher. You can find the link in the description below this video. We will be using this so that we don't need to install Java. Also using the link in the description below this video, go to the website and download gportable. You can see there is a 32-bit and 64-bit version. Download the 64-bit version from here. It's thanks to portable apps and the portable Java version that we are able to use Minecraft on computers that don't have Java installed. First, let's extract the Java Portable Launcher. Click OK and then on Next. Then click on Browse and select the folder called Minecraft that you have created previously. Click OK again, click on Install and click on Finish. We will need to repeat the same procedure with the Java Portable app. Click on Browse and select the folder named Minecraft that you have created previously. Now this next step, it's very important to make the program work properly. You will need to type in common files before the Java64 name and to delete the number 64. Make sure it appears exactly as in the description and then click on install. The program will download the necessary files from the original website and it will put them in the Minecraft folder. That's it! Now we have everything we need to make Minecraft portable. To start playing, go to the Minecraft folder that you have created, go to Java Portable Launcher and run the application. The first time you do this, you will need to choose the Minecraft folder manually and to select the Minecraft .exe file. In order for the .exe files to appear, you will need to click on Share Files and select All Files. Now choose Minecraft .exe and click on Open. You should now see the Minecraft launcher appear and download all the necessary files. If you are using third-party apps, always be careful when asked to enter your username or password. Since here we are using the original Minecraft launcher, it's safe to log in. In case you don't have a premium account yet, you can also try the demo version, which you can get by registering a free account on the original Minecraft website. The demo version is a good way to try and experience Minecraft, and it has most of the features of the full game, but it's limited to 100 minutes of gameplay time. Since everything is working, we can quit the game now. When you want to start the game again, just use the Java Portable Launcher and select Minecraft Exe. All your Minecraft data and your save games will be inside the Java Portable Launcher App Data folder so you can carry it with you even on a USB drive. Congratulations! You've just made Minecraft portable and you can use it without having Java installed. You can also use this same procedure to make almost any Java application portable. I hope you find this tutorial useful and thank you for watching.